Hi hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Gabourey Sidibe has revealed that she had a laparoscopic bariatric surgery last May. The Empire actress wrote in her memoir, This is just my face, try not to stare, that the decision was a long time coming after battling bulimia as a child and being diagnosed with type 2 diabetes. The actress got candid about her weight loss journey in a new interview with People magazine. Sidibe knew she was different than other children, even at the age of six, as she attended school in Harlem. I was a fat kid, she said. People said things about me that they didn't say about other kids. It wasn't long until her own family began making comments about her weight. Her mother once told her, Ugh, you're like a football player. You're going to knock me over. Her father encouraged her to lose weight so people could see how pretty she was. In high school... Gabourey learned to crack jokes about her weight before her classmates had the chance. She would talk about dragging my fat ass around the gym to make people laugh. However, she was really hurting on the inside and began throwing up to lose weight. The bulimia stuck around for about three years, she said. Throwing up made me feel high. In 2016, her doctors told Sidibe she should have weight loss surgery, so she checked into UCLA Medical Centre, the actress stated. After 11 years of saying surgery will be the last resort, I was finally here. Gabourey said, my surgeon said they'd cut my stomach in half. This would limit my hunger and capacity to eat. My brain chemistry would change and I'd want to eat healthier. I'll take it. My lifelong relationship with food had to change. She adds, the surgery wasn't the easy way out. I wasn't cheating by getting it done. I wouldn't have been able to lose as much as I'd lost without it. She feels surgery was the right choice for her. She wrote in her memoir, This is just my face, try not to stare. It has taken me years to realise that what I was born with is all beautiful. I did not get this surgery to be beautiful. I did it so I can walk around comfortably in heels. I want to do a cartwheel. I want to not be in pain every time I walk up a flight of stairs. There's nothing ugly about me. Anyone trying to convince me that I am, and it's usually me, is wasting her time. I was in a war with my body for a long time. If I'd started treating it better sooner, I wouldn't have spent so many years hating myself. But I love my body now. Sidibe adds, My beauty doesn't come from a mirror. Never has, never will. Thanks for listening. Please like, comment and subscribe.